The first in the year 2023, you know, I was looking, AAA predicts that this is going to be the busiest travel day of the year, but you mm -hmm. know what? 2022 was yep. the busiest one, 2021. Uh -huh. yep. I don't think 2020 nope. was, <laughs> but 19 was. We took was. a break there, yeah. So it's just every year is its busiest travel day before Thanksgiving on Wednesday. Well, you get more and more people and, uh, you know, there's people wanting to hit the road. But yeah, it's always interesting that Thanksgiving is more people travel over that holiday than Christmas. I don't know why yeah. that's interesting to me. It's just eh, something that's, uh, I don't think you'd necessarily expect it. But here we are. Speaking of which, we're just uh, about a week away. If you've got travel plans, I think you could run into some speed bumps on Tuesday. But for Wednesday, not so much. A live look at downtown. Temperatures are in the 50s and 60s right now. 57 in Macon, 54 over in Warner Robins. 58 in Cochran, 61 in Dublin, 60 in Soperton this morning. How about 61 in Wrightsville and 56 over in Gray? How about the forecast for the next three days, though? 75 today, 76 for Saturday, 72 on Sunday. It's a little warmer than we should be for this time of year. Average high right now is right around 69, but plenty of sun. I'd say get outside and enjoy it because we're going to be looking at cooler temperatures by the time we get to next week. The radar is quiet right now. Could be looking at the sprinkles in a couple of spots this morning and then a little more unsettled once you work your way down towards Jacksonville, Savannah, St. Simons, Charleston this morning. That's going to stay down there. That's that coastal low pressure system pulling away. And then we've got scattered showers from northern Mississippi on in through western Kentucky this morning. That's actually a longer front that's going to cool us off later on this weekend. But for today, we're going to have cloud cover through majority of the day. Temperatures warming into the 70s. You saw a few green dots there. That's the sprinkles through the afternoon hours. And then once we get into the night tonight, not going to be cooling off all that much because that cloud cover is going to be in place, kind of acting as a blanket. So only getting down to 60 tomorrow morning. And then for tomorrow afternoon, mid 70s across central Georgia with plenty of sun to go around. And that, and that carries us into tomorrow night. But as for tonight, 72 going to be that temperature for the tailgating hour sunset around 532. It's week two of high school football playoffs, maybe a sprinkle for kickoff, but I do think we'll be mostly dry by the time we wrap things up. And the key word here is maybe. I don't think that's a guarantee by any stretch of the imagination. Carries us into next week. Sunday looks dry. Monday, maybe a shower or two, but then Tuesday comes around and here comes some storms out to the west. You're going to hear about a big severe weather potential in the southeastern United States next week. That's going to be in Alabama and Mississippi. This line of storms going to be weakening as it comes into central Georgia late and the night on Tuesday should be out of here by early Wednesday morning. We could see a rumble of thunder or two, maybe a strong storm or two, but I would not be too concerned about this by any stretch of the imagination. That does clear us out in time for Thanksgiving. Speaking of which, I think we're headed for a high of only 58 on Thanksgiving day after an overnight low right around 35. A chilly day after the cold front moves through across central Georgia, so uh, a little cooler than we should be. Speaking of which, we do need the rainfall. Here's where November stands now. You might remember October very dry for us. November trending dry as well. Hopefully we can get another uh, inch or so of rain out of this and this would put us uh, close to normal for November. But so far only three quarters of an inch oh, through the weekend only picked up 15 one hundredths of an inch. All of that gloomy weather just for that. Bus stop forecast 50s this morning, 70s later on today. Mostly cloudy skies with maybe a sprinkle. There is Tom the turkey dancing away on Thanksgiving Day. We've got pretty nice weekend with some storms before that forward down into the 50s for highs for Wednesday and Thursday.